A new report from the World Meteorological Organization says weather disasters around the world are happening four to five times more often today than in the 1970s. These disasters affect everybody in the world. Not only that, they're causing seven times as much damage as they did five decades ago. The reason for that is basically that we're building more. We're building in vulnerable areas, tropical cyclones, number one, as well as we're not building well enough. And economic losses from disasters totaling 3.6 trillion US dollars over 50 years will continue to escalate with climate change. With devastating wildfires in British Columbia this summer, that's already being seen by the Canadian Red Cross in their disaster relief work. What we're seeing now is a higher severity, longer duration, and overlapping of natural disaster event seasons. But it's not all bad news. The report says weather disasters are killing fewer people than they used to. In the 1970s and 80s, an average of about 170 people a day died worldwide in climate events. In the 2010s, that dropped to about 40 per day because of better emergency preparedness in many countries. Climate change is an important issue in the federal election campaign, but some say every party's platforms need to focus more on disaster preparation. I do think we tend to focus on mitigation. How do we prevent climate change? Um, how do we reduce our emissions? And that's extremely important. Um, but have probably had less attention to preparedness and um, adaptation. An urgent call to action to combat climate change and to get ready for far more weather disasters in the future. Inayat Singh, CBC News, Toronto.